Hey guys and welcome to Vlogmas Day 12. Again, we are going to do some baking, but not until later on. Because first off, we're going into the doctors with John to get to know where, whether or not he has asthma. Um, he has done like a breathing test, test last week and it did look a little bit weird, so going to be interesting to see whether or not he needs an inhaler or not. Um, so today I was thinking I was going to make sweet buns and um, but I do think um, that we're going to make um, Lucia buns instead because today they had Lucia in school and because John was at, his, at the doctor he did, didn't get to join because he only arrived at school after it was all done. So I thought me and John and maybe baby girl would make Lucia buns today. And if you don't know who Lucia was, she's a saint. Uh, she used to walk around in all white with a crown of lights on her head. Because in her hands she would have pastries. And she would walk around to the poor people and hand out pastries to them. Uh, I think actually she would walk around to, in the mines and that was why she had light on her head and she would hand out pastries and the special thing about these pastries was that they were yellow in colour they would normally use saffron but saffron is like 10 times more expensive than gold so it's quite the expensive um, seasoning um, in Norway we have something that we use it's called gurkemeyer which is a yellow seasoning that you can use in these buns to make the dough yellow it doesn't taste the same as saffron but it doesn't really taste anything so yeah so i think we're going to do that tonight but first off we're going to head out to the doctors and get to know the sentencing or get to know if John has asthma or not. And I am actually going to make myself a chai tea latte. Yeah. I love this coffee. And I actually had one left, so I'm gonna make me it. So I shall get back to you guys a little bit later. Hey guys, okay so we have just finished at the doctor's and I'm now currently standing outside John's school. Um, so yeah. My camera doesn't want to stand on the road. No. Hang on. Oh, sorry, I, I just keep doing things that I'm not supposed to be doing while filming. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I know. Weird girl. Weird girl. Or oh, weird lady. I'm an old lady. Like that. Oh yeah. Okay. Hey guys. Okay. So we have just arrived back to John's school after he had been to the doctors and I'm oh, sorry for the lighting we have winter time it's actually not really light outside even though it looks like around me so yeah um, so I'm now standing just outside John's school um, took him into school and my darling son has asthma so yeah he has now gotten one of the inhaler thingies and he's going to test that out and hopefully that will be enough. Um, so, yeah, um, don't know what to say about it really. Music is quite easy, I think. Yeah, and they just turned out the light and that was not good. Oh well, oh well. So I'm now going to go back home and what I'm going to do back home, I'm going to bake, yeah, even more baking. Sorry guys, 
I might actually be doing several today um, or actually I might just have to divide it up yeah I think I'm gonna divide it up mm -hmm. okay and hang on yes can I show you guys something strapped in for this a little bit hard. I got mail. I ordered something from this store called Flust. Uh, we have like these cards that you can get bonus points on and you can use your bonus points on this store. And I decided to use mine on that store. And what I ordered arrived today. So I'm just trying to get this open so I can show you guys. And it was a little bit harder than what I thought it would be. And I'm going to take scissors, I think. Come. I'm sorry. I'm a little bit slow. Weird, weird lady. There we go. Okay. I think. Come on. So, what did I order? First off. Hang on. Hang on. <gasps> we are bubble wrap! I like bubble wrap, but I think I'm going to have to save this for John because he loves it even more than me. So yeah, I'm going to be kind to him and save it. And now, I got this little thingy. I got me an ice cream maker. And this comes with recipes, two bowls and the, the ice cream machine itself. And it makes ice cream in 10 to 12 minutes. And it can make two times 0 0.32 liters. So it can make about 64 milliliters. No, deciliters. Sorry guys. Yeah, I'm a little bit. So I'm really looking forward to seeing this thingy. Let's see if I can open it or if it's tape shut. I'm so, so, so looking forward to trying this. And the balls are so pretty. I ordered the pink one. You, you kind of wouldn't guess I would order the pink one. Yeah. Um, because I love pink. So, yeah. Oh, it, it's packed really, really well. So, I'm not going to take it out right now. But the bowls are really pretty so you can serve your ice cream in the bowl itself so yeah okay so now off home I go to make bread yeah. <sighs> but I think I'm gonna film making lucicotta for the vlog and maybe do the bread in different video but you're gonna get to see everything so yeah Okay, see you soon. Gotta drive. Ooh. You want to see outside? Because we have lost lost most of our snow. See this? It rained away. So now it's only ice. <laughs> Need a light, guys. But yep, see you in a little bit. So hey guys. Okay, so. As I said, I was going to bake again today. We are going to make lucicata, um, a lucia buns, but I'm going to do this with the normal bun recipe, sweet bun recipe that I have, and just um, add in um, what's needed to make them lucia -ish. So I'm going to show you guys the recipe I use first and then I'll, I'll add in what's needed 
So hang on a sec. And yes, I do make a lot of mess. Hang on. I make a lot of mess and I have my baby girl here. Like that, I hope. Kind of hard seeing myself. I'm sorry for everything stacked. Okay, so what you'll need, you'll need one bag of yeast. I use dry yeast. You will need um, one teaspoon of yeah. baking powder or baking soda. You, I use two teaspoons of vanilla sugar. You will need half a teaspoon of cardamom and a half a teaspoon of salt. You will need one liter of uh, flour. I guess you guys say multi-purpose or all-purpose flour. And then I, in here I have one deciliter of sugar. And what you do is you um, and here in this one I have a um, hundred grams of butter and four deciliters of uh, light milk and this is heated um, you melt the butter pour in the milk and heat it up so that it's basically you can touch it with your finger without getting burned so hang on my baby girl is stealing you guys She's a little bit of pain. Um, so you're just gonna add all the dry ingredients into your mixing bowl. So all of those ingredients will make the plain buns. But since I am making Lucia ones, we have this one called Gurkemeja. Um Not really sure what this is called in English. Uh, but you can use this. It's a lot cheaper than saffron. But I actually went to the pharmacy and bought saffron today. And I'm just going to show you guys this. Because you see this big box. This big box. I'm going to show you guys what I mean when I'm saying that saffron has a higher, uh, 10 times higher kilo price than gold. Because this little thing right here is all that's in that box. And if I were to put it on here, more weight, I don't think I would have much weight. My weight doesn't even register that. So it's not even one gram, this whole thing. Yeah. And this thing cost me eight dollars. Or it cost me um, five pounds. Five pounds, eight dollars, I think that's about right. So yeah. That goes to show you how expensive this is, but you only need a teeny tiny bit to make this. So we're going to see how we can open this and add in a little tiny bit of this. I am terrified of dropping this. because it is so expensive and I just figured out easy to do for it. So yeah. So there we go. I am now taking only this teeny tiny amount putting it into my dough. And I think that should be enough. I'm basically I'm doing this from my head so yeah now I'm going to add in the yeast just got to cut it open and 
if it's not enough saffron, I'm gonna add in a little bit more. So, yeah. Okay. Now I'm just gonna be mixing this while pouring in the milk and butter and messing everything up. Hang on. your dough is a little bit on the sticky side you can add more flour I've got to get more Shade guys, hang on. Let's see if I can do this. I'll show you guys in the bowl. You can see this is a little bit sticky. So I'm adding more flour to it. Taking about this much at a time. Putting it in there. And I'm gonna need more. starts to loosen from the sides of the bowl. It is about ready. One more. And that should be enough, I think. You see it's starting to loosen from the sides. But I do think it's still a little bit too loose, so I'm going to add more because I want it, it has to dough slide down first. And the dough feels pretty good. Now I'm gonna start doing Okay, I'm gonna have to 
do that one more time. So I'm just going to hurry this process up a little bit. Pushing it down with a spatula. Like that. Now I'm just going to... Like that. And now this dough is going to have to sit for about an hour. Uh, you put plastic over and let it sit to so it can rise. So I'll be back once that's done. So you guys, we are now back and I got my babies. Because then we're going to make uh, Lucy got that or Lucia buns. Our baby girl is having fun with the flour on the table. Yeah. So we're just going to let them get started. The dough was actually rising for about half an hour because we had to have dinner in between it all. Oh, yeah. And where did I put my knife? You can't brat. So I'm just going to make a little one for the baby girl so she can make something. Come on, Lisa. I'm sorry, we are speaking Norwegian. understood he was for eating and I was probably in the way of the camera but she was eating the dough so yeah as you might see do we have some hair some we have that some we have I can't see how big you are hello you better feel really good you have some of it Jag måste göra sånt som Boa gör. Åh, oh, är det flink det? Ja. Ser du flink det, baby? Jag satte den just där. Ser du mer sånt? Jag måste ta bort det där som du har spist på. Throwing away the little bit. Nej. Jag måste göra sånt. Flink det, ja. I'm gonna have a seat as well. I assume you. I'm trying to be small, but I'm trying to be a dick. Mm-hmm. Let's get that. For school, so took we first a stool bed, and so really we then you. Ah, a flank. Oh, yeah, what's that? What did you do? What did you do? Og jeg skulle ha det ned. Jeg sier mamma har råd å gå opp. Sånn, du må gjøre sånn. Sånn må vi gjøre. Så må jeg rulle. Rulle, rulle, rulle. Hvor tynn skal de være? Den her skal være rulle. Fint. Men den her? Det var jo du selv. Er det greit? Ja, her er det. Maybe the girl just don't understand the principle <laughs> of making. <laughs> the way you got my day night. <laughs> what do you want to rest up? I think we'll have her um, kind of locked up with <laughs> picking dough for some time. I'm just going to remove these. Yeah. So baby girl is having fun, <laughs> eating dough. Yeah. 
guess that's what's to be expected when you have a baby. Go on, mean day. Jeg er ikke så mørt. Sånn. Det må du ikke gjøre, da. Så var det på noen nivå. Ganske så døgn. Ja. Må du lage sånn her livet ditt? Må du løse sånn? Er vi ferdig med den? Kom, man må lage den der borte. Kom, man må få. Takk, takk. Takk, takk. Baby girl mage. I don't know, it kind of looks like one of those yeah. rubber chickens. Yeah. Um, but she's gonna get it. So, gotta make her a new little piece. Ah! Watch it go. Watch it go, we do a little, little, little. So, it's not really good when they are raw, Snippa Me. It's much better when they are stacked. Inte nu, jag är mån för så. Här var det snurrack. Nu är det så kort man plattar. Jag har en härlighet, jag ska inte rada plattar i parks. Nu är det nix, ja. And I'm sorry I keep going in front of the camera. But yeah. Nej, ding dong. Ikke den ene enda, nei. Ikke den ene. I think baby girl is lacking flower on the table more than making anything. And her clothes looks like it's been through a war, but that's okay. She's a baby. Can you teach it? John how to braid? Yes, I can. What? Tar du de tre og så samler du de igjen. Sånn. Og så må du bare flatte. Sånn. En over. En over en. En over en. En over en. Om det er tjukk, så må du liksom dra litt i det. Okay, we put light in it. For the end. Oh yeah! What are you doing with it? Yeah. Yeah, we better when we're going to make make pepper cake. It's better to spice it. Isn't it? Yeah. So let's do one over one. And one over one. Nå har du ikke festet det, Markusen. Det er lurt å ta den først, den er underst. Så den legger du over en. Og så legger du neste over en. Over en, ikke over to. Over en. Jag tar bara sån, så tar du den där sista. Det är väl sån. Jag lägger den här sån. Långsån. Det är en av den. Okej, you guys. I'm not going to bore you guys anymore with this. And you can see all our lovely 
gun stuff, yeah. But that is Lucy Cadet. I'm going to include some pictures on my blog so you can see the result. So, hang on. Ooh, okay. So that. My little pain in the bum behind there. So that was a Vlogmas day 12. Yeah. So I shall get back to helping my kids. And I love you guys so much. If you decide to make anything, tweet me, Instagram me. Yeah, you'll find me mostly um, at Niemur. Well, everything is down below. All my info is down below so it's all good but um that was it for today love you guys so much bye see you soon i totally forgot to tell you guys this recipe i uh do it on 205 degrees for 10 to 15 minutes in the middle of the oven i tried the same recipe on 215 degrees yesterday and that was too hot in my oven I have an oven that's about three years old. So if you have an older oven, it's supposed to go in at 225 Celsius. So yeah, um, you have to kind of know your oven if it's going on the hotter side or a little bit cooler. So yeah, test it out. It's all I can say, but for me on a new oven, 200. 5, 210 should be enough because 215 was too much so yeah I'm sorry I forgot that but bye see you tomorrow